hello and welcome to Buttermere. I've been here about an hour now and I think it's fair to say I've not chosen the best light conditions but then again <laughs> light conditions always seem to be against me. Um, I've just been having to go at pretty much the iconic shot of uh, the white building uh, with the mounting as a backdrop. Um, oh, sorry excuse me just doing a long exposure shot. <laughs> My alarm's gone off. Yeah, I've done the uh, iconic shot of the uh, white building. Unfortunately, the, the light isn't good enough for that. Unfortunately, about a year ago, I came here and the light was just perfect for evening. Um, unfortunately, I ended up going around uh, a different bit of the water and didn't quite make it to where I want to be. So, uh, lesson learned: if you stop and see, well, if you see something, stop and shoot it. Um, otherwise, you're going to miss it. I've also done. Uh, a shot of trees over here, somewhere along here. It's another classic shot. Again, the light's not brilliant, so I just thought I'd have a mess around. Annoyingly, uh, the light is messing me around today. As I was uh, shooting the building, I um, turned around and saw the light was happening over here. Um, got myself all packed up, started to make my way over here. As soon as I did that, the light disappeared, and then uh, <laughs> the light made its way back over there briefly on a uh, little uh, stretch of I think Caledonian pines um, like to the left of the normal view that you uh, you would see in books um, but yeah so I missed that as well so not doing too well um, never mind so I've got a bit of time yet before sunset obviously it's going to get dark around here because of the, the hills and mountains around me I'm going to lose the light a lot quicker than normally um, but hopefully I'm still going to get a bit of light come over this way. It keeps um, like going in and out. The gaps in the cloud kind of just eluding me at the moment. But uh, hopefully if I uh, show a bit of patience, I will uh, get a nice image in. Okay, I'm just going to carry on playing with my long exposures. Um, if nothing else, that's going to make a nice image. <laughs> I'll put that up in a minute. And uh, yeah, we'll see where we go from there. Well, they say all good things come to those who wait, and although I'd given up waiting for the light at Buttermere, I was rewarded with this absolutely stunning scene um, that you see on the screen now, as I uh, came over the top of the Honester Pass, a route which I've uh, never actually <laughs> travelled before. In fact, I didn't even realise it was there, otherwise I, I would have been in and out of Buttermere uh, this way, because the, the scenery is absolutely gorgeous. And as you can see, I finally received the light that I uh, had been hoping for, um, of which I don't think I've quite captured the uh, the awesomeness of the scene in this image, um, but I've done my best. And uh, not only does this scene mark the uh, end of what was a, a relatively disappointing day as far as light was concerned, it's actually also the end of this video as I uh, managed not to record any other footage. Um, hope you've enjoyed today's video and uh, I'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.